And so she has also made it clear, though, that if any of her deputy clerks are compelled to issue licenses out of her office, unauthorized licenses, that is, they will be issued on modified forms, forms that do not have Kim Davis's name, her title, her office, or her authority, forms that expressly state that they are issued pursuant to a federal court order. The court has indicated that it was willing to accept some modifications of the marriage license in order to accommodate Kim Davis's convictions and faith. Did, did she give that order? Kim Davis did modify the licenses in order to try to find a common sense, reasonable way to move forward. She does not want to defy the orders of a federal court. She wants very much to be able to comply. She doesn't want to be a whipping post and she doesn't want to be a martyr and she doesn't want to be incarcerated. Um, right now, Kim Davis is focused on winning a reasonable accommodation for her religious beliefs. We have not yet discussed what will happen with the unauthorized licenses that have been issued by her office. They will have to remain in legal limbo for now until hopefully the governor or the legislature intervene to change the law. Was that why they were such a delay this 